What's something people don't know about consciousness after death? Since the dawn of self-awareness, humanity has grappled with a profound question. What happens to our consciousness after death? Do we simply cease to exist? Or does some part of us persist beyond the mortal shell? Despite centuries of contemplation, the answer remains elusive, shrouded in mystery and subject to a spectrum of beliefs. Some find comfort in the notion of an afterlife, while others find solace in the finality of death. Regardless of our beliefs, the question of consciousness after death continues to fascinate and haunt us, urging us to explore the uncharted territories of our existence. As we ponder this eternal question, we are reminded of our own mortality and the mysteries that lie beyond. Through science, philosophy, and spirituality, we seek answers, hoping to uncover the truth about the eternal mind. Join us as we delve into the depths of this timeless enigma, exploring the possibilities of consciousness beyond death. My journey into this mystery began with a harrowing brush with death. Struck by a rare form of bacterial meningitis, I spent seven days in a coma, my brain ravaged by infection. The doctors held little hope for my survival, seeing only a ravaged body. Yet, while my physical form lay tethered to machines, my consciousness embarked on an extraordinary odyssey. I found myself in a realm of unimaginable beauty and complexity, far beyond earthly reality. This was not a dreamlike state, but a realm of vibrant, hyper-real landscapes pulsating with life and peace. I encountered beings of pure light, their communication transcending language. They guided me through ethereal realms revealing profound truths about reality and the eternal nature of consciousness. This experience shattered my materialistic worldview, revealing a dimension of existence I had never thought possible. As I journeyed further, I felt an overwhelming sense of unity with the cosmos, a connection that transcended time and space. Eventually, I returned to my physical body, forever changed by the profound insights and experiences from beyond the veil. The idea that consciousness might survive bodily death is not new. It has been woven into human cultures for millennia, expressed through myths, religions, and spiritual traditions. Ancient Egyptians believed in the Ka, an eternal spirit journeying through the underworld. Tibetan Buddhists describe reincarnation, where consciousness transmigrates from one life to the next. Indigenous cultures revere ancestors and spirits, believing in their continued presence. These beliefs share a common thread, the belief in a soul or spirit that transcends physical death. While often dismissed as folklore, modern science finds intriguing parallels with ancient wisdom. Quantum physics suggests our universe might be far stranger and more interconnected than we imagined, hinting that ancient beliefs may hold a grain of truth. As we delve deeper into both ancient texts and modern research, the timeless quest to understand consciousness continues. The journey to uncover the mysteries of the mind and its potential eternity is as old as humanity itself, and it shows no signs of ending. At the heart of the debate over life after death lies the mind-body problem. This question ponders the relationship between our physical selves and our subjective experiences. Is the mind merely a product of the brain, ceasing upon death, or is it an independent entity? Materialist philosophers argue that consciousness is reducible to brain activity, pointing to evidence linking brain structure to subjective experiences. However, this view fails to fully account for the qualitative nature of consciousness, the feeling of what it is like to experience the world. These subjective experiences, or qualia, remain resistant to explanation in purely physical terms. This enduring mystery suggests that the relationship between mind and body may be far more complex than we currently understand. As we delve deeper into this enigma, we find that the mind-body problem touches on the very essence of what it means to be human. Whether through scientific inquiry or philosophical contemplation, the journey to unravel the mind-body connection continues, inviting us to explore the profound depths of our own existence. Some scientists and philosophers have turned to quantum mechanics to shed light on the enigma of consciousness. Quantum mechanics, governing particles at atomic levels, is rife with counterintuitive principles. Quantum entanglement links particles across vast distances, influencing each other instantaneously. This interconnectedness has led some to speculate about a possible link to consciousness. Quantum superposition, where a particle exists in multiple states until observed, raises questions about consciousness's role in collapsing the wave function. 
Some theorize that our brains might act as receivers of a universal field of consciousness. This field could potentially survive the death of the physical body, allowing consciousness to persist. While speculative, these ideas offer a thought-provoking alternative to purely materialistic explanations of consciousness. The leap of faith required to accept these theories is significant, yet it opens up a realm of possibilities that challenge our understanding of life and death. Near-death experiences NDEs, offer another window into the possibility of consciousness beyond death. These profound experiences reported by individuals close to death share striking similarities across cultures. NDEs often involve a sense of leaving one's body, traveling through a tunnel, and encountering deceased loved ones. While some attribute NDEs to physiological changes in the brain, others argue these explanations fail to account for their richness and transformative power. Many NDRs report a profound sense of peace and unconditional love often returning with verifiable information. While not definitive proof, NDEs offer compelling anecdotal evidence that consciousness may be more resilient than we understand. Some enders describe a life review where they relive significant moments, often leading to a spiritual awakening. Scientific studies continue to explore these experiences, seeking to understand their origins and implications. Regardless of the cause, NDEs often result in profound personal transformation offering new perspectives on life and death. Despite compelling evidence suggesting consciousness beyond death, skepticism remains strong. Skeptics point out the lack of definitive, scientifically verifiable proof for an afterlife. They argue that NDEs can be explained by physiological changes and quantum consciousness theories are speculative. Skepticism emphasizes critical thinking, cautioning against wishful thinking and the human tendency to find patterns where none exist. The burden of proof lies with those claiming an afterlife, requiring extraordinary evidence. Constructive skepticism challenges us to question assumptions, demand rigorous evidence, and remain open to alternative explanations. In the end, the quest for understanding consciousness beyond death is a journey that requires patience, open-mindedness, and a willingness to explore the unknown. While the debate over consciousness after death continues, one thing is certain. The universe is vast and mysterious. Our current scientific understanding is still in its infancy, constantly challenged by new discoveries. The human brain remains one of the most complex entities in the known universe. We are only beginning to unravel the mysteries of consciousness, memory, and the self. To assume we possess all the answers to life's biggest questions is hubris. The history of science shows that once unthinkable ideas often become the foundation for future understanding. As we continue to explore the cosmos, we uncover more questions than answers. Both philosophers and scientists strive to understand our place in this vast universe. The interconnectedness of life in the cosmos suggests a deeper, more profound reality. Future scientific endeavors and space exploration may one day provide insights into the nature of consciousness. Until then, we remain explorers seeking to understand the eternal mysteries of the mind and the universe. The most profound realization from this exploration is the vastness of our own ignorance. We are limited by our senses, instruments, and current scientific paradigms. The question of consciousness after death becomes an invitation to explore, pushing the boundaries of our understanding and embracing the mystery at the heart of existence. This exploration demands courage, intellectual honesty, and a willingness to confront our deepest fears. It requires us to question everything we know, stepping outside our comfort zones. The rewards are immeasurable, leading to a journey of self-discovery and a quest to unravel the enigma of our existence. We begin to see the world and ourselves in a new light, appreciating the interconnectedness of all things. Whether or not we find definitive answers to life after death, the true value lies in the journey itself. It expands our awareness and humbles us, revealing that we are part of something far grander and more mysterious than we can imagine. So let us embrace this journey with open hearts and minds, knowing that every step we take brings us closer to understanding the profound mysteries of life and consciousness. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel if you like this kind of content.